All right. Loyalty or lust? Will her boyfriend cheat with another woman? Mm, loyalty or lust? Being at the fact that this is the decoy, I'm not going to lie. She looks bad as f***. So, but the girlfriend looks good too. Don't get me wrong, but shit. We'll see how this go. Y'all think he's cheating? I know we said over there, but just like. And she got braces? As much as I don't want to say it, do what you got to do. You yeah. Know? I might fold. This the, oh, that's the decoy. Oh, yeah. She's always bad. Yo, whenever they use her as the decoy, bro, she's bad as fuck, bro. Like. Today, we're replacing Crown's boyfriend to a loyalty test. How are you feeling about everything? I'm a little nervous, but. Having any second thoughts, any regrets? At this point, you can, no. Our friends, Madeline, will be. But. Having any second thoughts, any regrets? At this point, you can, no. Our but she sound like she's crying. Friends Madeline will be testing Sean's loyalty by hitting her. Can't turn? I'm going. Call me a milkman. I don't give a fuck. I am a winter soldier. On him and asking him on a date, will he remain loyal or will he entertain Madeline's advances? I always hope that they're not down. Like, I'm, I'm sorry. But also, like, Damn. we gotta free our homegirls from their boyfriends, you know? Hey, baby. What's up? Did you get my text from last night? Oh, a fake or real? Which one? The, the one about picking my charger up from my friend's house. What about it? Uh, I was just calling to make sure that you got it and you don't forget. Um, did you check like how far her house is? No, hold up, let me see. Sean's loyalty test will be taking place in this LA home. Damn. Madeline is pretending to live here. To get him over, Crown asked him to pick up her laptop charger that she supposedly left behind. It shouldn't be that far, honestly. Uh, just make sure she told me she'll be home or she'll be free, like between three and five. And actually, I'm gonna give you her number. And um, yeah, I'll text you her number after and then you can, you know, just kind of like facilitate that whole thing with her. Okay, sounds good. Thank you so much. Um, my boss is like right in my ass right now, so I have to go, but I love you and right. thank you so much. You're welcome. Okay, I love you. Love you too. Love you too. You had to say it twice. Okay. So, oh my God, who is that? Oh, so my boyfriend. He used to work at. Mm -hmm. Um, I had another friend who also worked at. They were coworkers or whatever. Um, and she worked in a different department than him, but she would tell me that there was a girl who did work in his department who. At first, it was just kind of like whatever, but then it ended up being like they were really friendly with each other. Mm. And I don't know, as somebody who's in a relationship, I just right that raised right. red flags for me. Right, I so, feel that. Yeah, asked him about the relationship, what was going on there, if there was something at all. Um, and he said that they were just friends, everything was cool, you know. Um, so. What is your friend? She don't look like the type of like girl to let a nigga cheat on her though say like they flirt a lot or how does well let me just be honest she's biased because she's on my team so yeah she she really does she, make it seem you know like she bit, does yeah. yeah she says they flirt all the time they take their lunches together and on their lunch it's not like hey like oh you happen to be eating lunch let me sit down it's like let's go take our lunches together right and then yeah. multiple times like okay one little lunch whatever right yeah. but then it's like damn a nigga can't have a colleague like what if he just like befriended someone that he can eat lunch with if I'm hearing like this is a consistent thing, like y'all yeah. are, what the f is this, you know? Yeah. Crown wanted to test her boyfriend's loyalty because she's been very suspicious of him talking to or cheating on her with his coworker. Well, technically his now ex coworker. You see, Sean eventually left that job, but he's still hanging out with the old coworkers and talking to that girl. He got fired from. Yeah, he can't help it with the groceries. Like, mm, be bonkers. And I'm not gonna lie, she look good though. Beautiful skin, beautiful woman. But she's a seven. I don't really like the braids. Actually, I, I do. I like I like the ends of the braids. I don't like the uh the braiding. I was low-key happy because it was like Yo, I'm lying. I'm chatting. I actually do like it. I, I like know. okay, now you She's like yeah, she's like a seven point nine though. You don't gotta deal with the girl. But then I found out like he's hanging out with the old She my type. Co-workers, he's going to bars with them. Oh wow. All type of like that. And she's there. Is she is he inviting you though? She looks like And he's out. not inviting me. No. Mm. And you know for a fact that when he goes out and hangs out with the coworkers that she's there? Yeah. Have you met her before? I never met her. Mm. Did you think to confront her ever? Like. Yeah, but at the same time, it's like if I don't know anything for certain, I can't just, you know what I mean? He might be a person that likes to hang out with his friends without involving his relationship. I hate. I actually hate that. I don't like when people involve their relationship when niggas need to hang out. Like, 
for instance, uh, like some like I've done the third wheeling, but sometimes you know it gets annoying. And, and it's really not her. I'm, I'm not. I don't have an issue with her. For sure. You know, for as much as I know, she don't even know he's in a relationship. Mm. But it's him. Yeah. Mm. He needs to understand that you're in a relationship, right. and that's just not how you operate. You know. And you said that one of the reasons why you want to trust him and you almost don't want to do this is because he gives you access to his phone. <laughs> he gave me the passcode a long time ago, and I, I don't know. I just never. Never used it. You've never checked his phone. I've never gone through his phone. I oh, Jayla, what the yeah, like just big for 41, Y'all yeah, appreciate you, Jayla, no college. Go, oh, I appreciate you. It was just my birthday. Wait, um, you're a Leo as well, right? I, I, one. My birthday was my birthday was Monday. If you know. I just feel like I don't have to. I shouldn't have to. Yeah. And then the other thing Welcome is back, like though. I feel I appreciate like if you're so stuff, adamant you. about me checking your phone, like you're so open to it, then you probably deleted the shit you don't want me to find. You know. Of course, now I feel like I should. Yo, do y'all do y'all be giving like for anyone who's in a relationship? Do y'all give y'all passwords to y'all to your significant other? Like password to like uh, like what? I don't know if y'all noticed, but. There's the uh, a new update to where you can put your sh on lock, right? Look. You need face ID. You can do this for every app now. I don't know. Uh, I'm pretty sure y'all probably don't have this uh, update yet, but you could do this for every app. Face ID. Face ID and password. Think this is staged? We're going to see right now. And it's like, I put it on there only because... Out of the pure thought that, oh, maybe what if one day, like, I get my phone confiscated by the police or some, you feel me? Like, there's no literal way to, to get that off. Like, I'll check the phone, yeah. but yeah. whatever. We're, We're going to see if this is staged or not. Here, whatever the outcome is, I'm going to accept it. I've given him a lot. We've the one, one reason why, like, as of right now, it's probably not staged because, well, it's a black woman. And I feel as though most normal black women don't occasionally know how to stage or no improv you feel you get what i'm saying so she nine times out of ten she's probably not an actor we've had so many conversations i've sat him down so many times and just being like like just be honest how you been jayla you know? he says he's being honest but it's just like there's different stories i'm getting different stories from different people that just don't add up with what you're saying and you know you know how people talk about like oh this is my work husband you know stuff like that oh, yeah. you know what i mean like i don't know i don't know i don't know if they're doing that type of but like, I'm gonna just have to be the crazy bitch today, cause I, I, I gotta know, I, you know. And by the way, feel free to do whatever. Okay? See, like that seemed like a genuine story. That seemed like a genuine story. What you think, Jayla? You think that this is stage? Okay, like, okay. So far, whatever you feel like will tempt him. How about it? She said, "Do whatever." <sighs> yeah, <sighs> suck that nigga. Are you 50-50? I'm fully 50 /50. fifty fifty. I don't know. I genuinely do not know. A part of me, you know, really trusts him, but we wouldn't be here yeah. if some people would say that doing a loyalty test would be like a break of trust as well. At the end of the day, this is it's something that I'm doing for, you know, the sake of saving my relationship. I don't want to just let it go or just go cheat, you know, and just go do my own thing just because I'm assuming that's what he's doing. You know, I wanna know for sure before I start making different moves. I think I think this is this nigga UDY's girlfriend. Assuming that's what he's doing, you know. I want to know for sure. Damn, why you got the moose snuggle on the on the camera, buddy? Before I start making different moves. I need a, I need a gym girl. I think she already knows though. I think she just wants solid. For sure, proof. but she doesn't have solid solid evidence yet, so. That's where you come in. Madeline began communicating with Sean and narrowed down his arrival time. We needed to control exactly when he would be coming. That's your car right there, right? Yep, that's me. Yeah, we definitely gotta move that. Let's yeah, yeah. If anything, we'll just have one of our guys. Moosey doosey. Yeah. Right street after making sure everything. Yeah, yeah. If anything, we'll. Oh my God, uh, look at that cyber truck. She look like a fucking fucking fridge we'll just have one of our guys see if you're okay with that yeah. drive it up the street after making sure everything and everyone was set up and ready to go all we had to do was just wait for him to arrive I'm scared <laughs> scared yeah i don't now? know like this is crazy oh no I always want to have faith in the male species, you mm. know? After waiting for another 30 minutes or so, Sean had finally arrived. There we go. Oh yeah, this is him. Hello? Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm outside. Okay, uh, can you come to the door and I'll come grab you? What are we watching? Read the title. 
Low to your lust. Will her boyfriend cheat on her while she's you no know, not aware? While she while he's with another woman, will he try to f her or will he? You know I me? Mean? Or is this fake? All right, sounds good. I thought girls see this. I I mean I thought girls be like watch like don't girls be watching shit like this? Is that his car? I think I couldn't even see. Oh no, nah, that's a good car. He drives a black car. That's Madeline CLA? makes her way to the front door to greet Sean. She carries a glass of champagne in her hand. Oh, he's coming. Oh. All right, y'all. Game face. The idea that is that Madeline's CLA? been day drinking, celebrating the release of her new music. So her job is to act a little tipsy. Hey, how are you, Madeline? What was your name again? Sean. Sean. Come on in. Thank you. Okay, here we go. We got him over. That's good. It's a good first step. Do girls generally wear dresses in the house on some regular shit? Sorry, that took so long. I was Hi, getting you're... more champagne and I'm here with my team right now. This uh, is Sean, guys. Yeah. He's here yeah. to get a charger. Yeah. Madeline introduces Sean to her supposed team. Her music producer, Nathan, and her manager, Kyle. If you guys recall, to narrow down his arrival time, Madeline told Sean that she had a meeting with them that would wrap up by the time that he got there. Congratulations on your new project, on your drop. I'm really excited to see that. I'm gonna send you some more beats tonight, too. Oh, yeah. I have, like, two more for, like, the next project. Let me know yes. what you think of them. I shepped up a little bit. And then I'll call yeah, you later here. with the numbers and how much everything Gonna cost. Okay, sounds so good, guys. Little bit. Nigga, that fit is ass. What the f are you wearing? Acid wash, muscle shirt, high water sweats, thunderbolt fours. What are you doing? Purple hat. I hate this. It's like this is really that LA drip. I'm not impressed. I'll call you later with the numbers and how much everything's gonna cost. Okay, sounds so good, guys. Nathan and Kyle fulfilled their jobs. A small role, but critical in getting Sean over at a certain time and also making sure that the rest of this test would be believable. I wish I knew that Crown was sending such a hunk to come over to get this charger. <laughs> I would have gotten ready a little bit more. Thanks. Would you like a drink? I'm good. Okay. I'm gonna put this away then. <laughs> I be crushing these side rolls, you feel me? I'm not just a decoy out here. He probably thinks I make the virest beats in the world, bro. Bro. Do you not know what bliss text is? I'm not just a decoy out here. He brother, ugh. What's that? What's that, brother? Nah, whoever edited this is grimy. Why would you ever get a screenshot of this nigga like that? That's up this nigga is ugly as shit oh, i think i make the virus beats in the world bro all right cool whatever it's fine he believes it uh, i usually don't date drinks but we're celebrating we're celebrating and celebrating i mean i i don't know you could can you keep a secret like, i really want to tell you i really want to tell you but you have to keep a secret okay you have to pinky swear pinky sure. swear okay pinky swearing with another bitch is crazy he already cheated he already cheated he already cheated. It's cracking, Jeff. Okay. I'm one of these, yes. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. He just made a heart with her hand. This nigga done. He's already done before this shit started. What's the question? Raymond Felton. Ain't that the ugly ass nigga? How much to turn gay? How much for me to turn gay? Bro. I am not attracted to men, bro. So no one like it wouldn't even be a million dollars. Like the Illuminati would even like the Illuminati cannot even grant me however much money to do such and such with a man, bro. Yeah, I gotta understand, bro. If if someone knocked at my door or emailed me and said, "Hey, hey, do such and such," uh, he not ugly. Do such and such, and we'll we'll make sure you're famous. I'm not doing it, bro. If it's some gay, shit, I'm not doing it, bro. No. If it involves me fucking a man, kissing a man, sucking a man's dick, anything. Involving a man. No. I like women. <laughs> I may say gay shit, but I'm not gay. <laughs> okay, come here with her. Oh I'm my god. My first single on my back's on AB today. And it's RB. That's really cool. Yeah. Nice. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Cheers. I'm literally like so excited about this. I can, I can tell. <laughs> Would you why be down to hear Why he sound like a bitch? You sure? Oh my god, bro. I got a girl, first thing I'm saying is my girl will be your ass. Come on. What if Ruby, what if Ruby doing this? 
Like, and the, the, the decoys Ruby. What? I'm going. I'm sorry. I'm cheating. A song? You know what? Actually, no. You hear a song, you tell me what you think, because I would love to have your opinion, and then I will give you the charger. It's like that. It's like that. Oh, Alright. I need some extra ears on this, you know? I can spare some time. Yay. And it looks like I don't have a choice anyways. <laughs> okay, let me just get some more of this real quick. You sure you don't want to drink? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. You sure? Okay. The next step of our plan would give us access to Sean's phone. Madeline just needed to execute it flawlessly. Are you positive that the password on his phone is still the same? I'm not positive, but I, I'm pr almost. Okay. You should. You should. Okay. The. Oh wait. Do you have your phone on you? Yes. Okay. Can you leave it there, please? Why? Because I don't want you to like be secretly recording and then possibly leak my new song. What am I? I'm not gonna leak. I, I'm sorry. I just don't trust you like that. I don't trust it like that. Please, just leave it right here. Seriously? Please. I'm so serious. All right. Let me see. Make sure you don't have anything else. Oh. But why is it that every time they do videos like this, if it's like with a black nigga, the nigga always sound white? What's that? It's my wallet. Chill. Oh. <laughs> sorry. I'm so sorry. What do you think it was? Honestly, you don't want to know. <laughs> oh, shit. Nah, she's good. Come on in. Madeline takes Sean into the office, closing the door behind her. I mean, it is LA here. though. I have a speaker it over is LA. here. Okay, let's let them start the music. A seemingly paranoid and tipsy Madeline successfully manages to convince Sean to leave his phone behind so that he wouldn't leak any of her new music. In reality though, we simply wanted the crown to have access to his phone. These songs, this whole project is based around a love interest. This one's acoustic though. Her music started. Yes, let's go. Oh my God. On top of seeing if Sean would cheat with Madeline, we also wanted to help Crown find out what the relationship between Sean and his ex-coworker was. Her name is Evelyn. Are she and Sean really just friends, or are they something more? I mean, remember guys, Evelyn was the whole reason why Crown wanted to do this test in the first place. We had to give her some sort of closure. You ready for this? We're live? We're, we're live. You sure about this? Positive about this? Yeah. yeah we once we do this, there's no going back. Doesn't this mean that this woman is very insecure? Oh, no. There's no going back once we do this. Oh! <gasps> it's I! Okay, I'll play it on my phone. Here. Now, I think many of you would agree that we should have followed Sean and Evelyn around and found out if they were hooking up. Remember how his phone is, okay? We considered it, but in the end, we didn't want to spend possibly weeks stalking them to hopefully catch them in the act. Next time, we'll send Nathan, though. It'd be better just to kind of catch them in the act of doing that. How do we have two weeks to go spy on these people? Don't you have anything better to do with your time? I definitely do, but I'm invested. You heard that shit before? And just like that, we were into Sean's phone. Now, we didn't want Crown to go through it. We simply wanted her to change her name with Evelyn's, delete both of their message threads, and then text Sean something with, hey babe, dot, dot, dot. We would then get Sean to look at his phone and he would hopefully think that it's Evelyn. His response to that text would tell Crown everything she needs to know. What? I might be slow, I don't know. Hey, Evelyn, but he's Eva, he's an Eva. Surprisingly, Crown couldn't find an Evelyn in his phone. All she found was an Eva, which could have been short for Evelyn. That one's you. Oh, so ah, you like it? <laughs> this one's called Gotta Have It. It was like my third favorite. Madeline continues playing more music to buy us more time. They be talk like they have how much how many songs is she playing? Because most songs are like usually like R and B is like three minutes, four minutes. Conversations. What the f let's see, okay, but do you see how some of these I think he's deleting shit because do you see how like some of these are getting there's so many gaps. Like he said this yesterday, right? Then the last message oh, is Thursday. She's in in trying to figure out if this was or wasn't Evelyn, Crown inevitably ended up reading some messages. I didn't want to show them because I wasn't sure if this was even his ex coworker, but their thread was interesting. There were gaps between messages. To give you guys a visual example, here's a message thread between me and my friend. You notice the gaps between our texts? Our thread looks like this because we hardly text each other. We communicate more through voice messages or just call each other. So Sean and this Eva girl didn't text each other very frequently or Sean was deleting messages. See, like there's so many gaps. And clearly, they, they be talking. He's deleting. Shit. He's deleting all the. Shit. See, like it's like he's deleting. Like check for so keywords. Wait, am I the only person that checks for keywords? Like I be, I would type, uh, so good or love or cute. 
or fuck or dick or vagina. You gotta go. You gotta look for those. So game much. is game. Are you sure this is Evelyn? Evelyn? Oh, I, 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 it's gotta be. I don't blame Cran for assuming the worst. I mean, we're filming a loyalty test after all. The reality, though, is that Sean may not be deleting messages. That doesn't mean that he and this girl aren't communicating in some other form, though. I'm good. I'm done. I'll, I'll see you. That's all. And if I switch Ava's name to my name. Yeah, once you do it, there's literally like no one back. Like, he's gonna know yeah. what you did eventually. He's gonna figure it out. Cran was convinced that Eva was short for Evelyn and that Sean was deleting messages, so she moved forward with our plan. Just Which is what, texting them or calling them? You're threatened. Oh yeah. And with that, our mission was accomplished. All we had to do now was send Sean that text. By the way, shout out to Madeline for holding him. She African? There. She actually did drop some new music, guys. That was a part of the test, but not an act. Go check it out and download it now. So this one's actually like, oh yeah, I could tell that she's got a little freak in it. Mm. Everyone gotta have a little you freak in it. <laughs> My heart is pounding. Oh my god. She looks like she's straight American. You think he's deleting? Uh, I don't think an African woman. I don't think an African woman would talk to a nigga that is black and whitewashed. You can hear it in his voice. Oh my god. They don't. They don't stray away from their. Uh, from their. You know. Yeah. Or you think. They could also be like voice chatting or like they're communicating like in some other form. Like maybe it's like a phone call or something or Snapchat or something. And then... I didn't even think about that. Nigga, her lips just black. What the fuck? Yo, that was racist. I should have checked all his now. Her lips are black. Most likely because she's dark skin or maybe she smokes, but probably, I don't know. Can't really tell if someone smokes or not, but most likely just because she's dark skin. <laughs> Uh, a part of me honestly I like how this others look good bad guys because crown had held off so long and not going through Sean's phone and our plan low-key made it go oh how does look good bad guys because crown had held off so long and not going through Sean's phone and our Facts. plan low-key made it go through his phone now we had her in her head about even she got she got brown lips you see how like as a brown skin most brown skins don't have like brown top lip pink bottom some people just have brown lips more things. Maybe it's gonna turn out to be nothing though. Maybe Eva isn't even Evelyn. Either way, uh, just the fact that they're like texting back and forth. I'm yeah, dark skin. Your right lips is black. Oh, we should probably just prepare the text that you're gonna. Oh, it's okay. Um, my hair. Okay. Bottle of red. Say hey, babe. Um, um, what you doing tonight? You maybe doing? not that tonight, because Madeline's about to ask oh, him. Oh, yeah. So hey, babe, what you doing? So he might get suspicious. Not okay. Don't tell me that. I'll let you know. Just hold on to it, yeah. I swear to God, if he responds something like... Ideally, he should say... How's he gonna respond if he doesn't have a phone? Who the f***, babe? What the f***? You mean to text this? Or yeah, like, yeah. you got the wrong number? You know, like... He better respond, babe. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. She changed the name to make it seem as if it was her. So when she types and she says, babe, to see his type of response. I get it. All this black, but don't look crazy? Yeah, her shit don't look crazy. I think, nah, that's definitely regular though. She is. You finally caught on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm an airhead. I'm an airhead. Airhead moment. Are these turtles kissing? Aw. Who the f is red? Something along those lines, right? <laughs> ah, thank you. He kind of brawled it. Oh, please tell me you like it. Please tell me. I need validation. Like, it's so good, honestly. Like, I really like them genuinely. Really? Some chopsticks? You're just saying that. Oh, well, you're I, just saying that because you want your charger back. Uh, you're actually really talented. Uh, I would listen to that. Yeah, he said he's a fan. Eight, 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 eight. Winning hearts, winning souls. Eight, eight, eight. eight, eight. <laughs> <laughs> I was only supposed to show you one song. It's okay. Uh, but I mean, I gotta get you out of here. <laughs> Let me get that charger for you. Okay, prepare to send the message. He's gonna grab his phone right now. Uh, I think it's in the living room though, or kitchen. Oh. Maybe we go check. To see if it's over here. Thank you so much, though, for taking the time. I know you're probably busy. Do you have any plans later? Uh, no plans. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Hold on. We're not done here. I just want to make sure you're not. Oh. Oh, okay. I think you go. This is your phone. Yeah, this is your phone. You got a text from Ava. Check your schedule too, but I have to use the restroom. So give me a second. I'll be back. Oh, okay, perfect. 
And so with that, our plan was done. Crown sent the text, Madeline made sure that he saw it, and now all we had to do was wait for his response. Is he texting? There's no doubt about it. Sean saw the text. But how would that how would that work if he can just see the history of the text messaging? What? The question was, what would he reply? Okay, I'm not gonna pee. I don't want you all to hear me. I really have to pee though. <laughs> Sean was on his phone, but no text was coming through. And he responded. He's not responding. No, he's just looking at it like. You think he's catching on? Mm, he could. At the same time, like, I don't know. This man really went radio silent on us. Like he's on his freaking phone. Madeline pointed out the message. He saw it. He read it. You got me thinking about family. <laughs> he's probably on social media or something. He's seriously not texting him. Huh? He's not texting back. He is- probably went on IG to text him like, yo, did you just text me? Seriously not. He's on his phone. He did, when, he did go through the text, but like he clears his evidence. So he's probably like a good cheater. He's on his phone, he's not. It's like, I know you saw that. Come on, Sean, give us something. Even if it's an emoji or a confused question mark, something to tell us the dynamic definitely, between you definitely and the real. girl's relationship. Prove us wrong about you. Now is your chance. Okay, I'm really going to go pee though, guys, because I got to go. I really thought he was going to text back. The only reason I can think of him not responding is that he's suspicious of it because there's no other messages. I mean, hopefully he thinks that he deleted the thread. Oh, I get it. Okay, there's, that's a little bit smarter. He probably, he, oh, he's probably, he was probably silent because he's like, yo, when the f did I delete the messages? That's true. I didn't think about that. That line is pink. So maybe he's it's like, suspicious about that but man i really thought we were going places with this plan but unfortunately not sean didn't text back a thing madeline gave it three to five minutes before going back outside more than enough time to take a piss and for this man to reply i thought we were going places i really really did oh my god i had a, maybe a little bit too much champagne <laughs> So sorry about that. We may never learn the dynamic between him and this Eva or Evelyn girl. I mean, if they're even the same person, but at least we are going to learn if he would be willing to go on a date with Madeline, which honestly still says a lot. By the way, just so you guys know, this was completely unplanned. The fact that you guys are matching. <laughs> I know. <laughs> that was literally down to the foot. Down to the foot. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> no free toes though. No free toes. <laughs> Already saw it. Mm. French tip. Wait, that's not French tip. White toes. Uh huh. No free toes though. No free toes. I'm gonna have half a glass more. Gotta keep the party going. So we are. <laughs> so did you get a chance to check your schedule? Okay. Cool. Yeah, I'm down to like. Done. Good thumbnail face. Like hang out. I I'll be done like around eight. Maybe we can meet like at nine. Yeah, I mean, what do you want to do, though? You want to stay here or you want to go out? Uh, probably just stay here. Have some more champagne. We can, like, chill in the jacuzzi. jacuzzi. I, I do, yeah. <laughs> bro, it's a already done deal. He doesn't know her from a can and a paint. Like, bro. I also have um, a few other songs I could show you, so maybe... I feel like for this, bro, like, that's already a fail. That's done. Exactly. There was no hesitation. That means this, he's doing this all the time. The fact that Sean was down to hang out with zero hesitation does say a lot. He probably already said... That's disrespectful, though, because this girl mad pretty, bro. This all the time. The fact that Sean was down to hang out with... She's dead pretty, bro. That's mad disrespectful, bro. This nigga. See, bro? Black ladies, I mean, black queens, don't be giving these whitewashed little niggas a chance, bro. You know what they going for, bro. They going for light-skinned women. Them colorist-ass niggas. Not like me. I ain't no colorist. Zero hesitation does say a lot. He probably already sensed Madeline subtly flirting with him, and he was with it. Maybe this is why he didn't text anything back. Well, I mean, it's none of my business, but who is Eva? 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 Yeah, she's just a friend. She's just checking in to see what I'm, you know, I was up to. Just a friend. Yeah, I mean, it not. seemed like a friend thing. <laughs> nah, she's playing. She's playing. She's just a friend. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I just don't want to step on any toes, you know? I'm like, obviously. I get it. Him and his and his, his work friend, 
they have a, a mutual agreement and they, they keep shit on the low. It's like planned type shit. So even if Eva was to respond, she probably wasn't going to say anything to the girlfriend. That happens all the time. Yeah, his girl, she dead ass look good. The crown is my friend. Like, I, when she. I'll be having fun making these thumbnails. I ain't gonna. She texted me earlier. She's like, hey, that's why he ain't respond. That's a fact. BF comes and picks up my charger. And, like, to me, I didn't click to me, like, oh, is it boyfriend or best friend? You know? So I was like. I mean, you know, we're a thing, I guess. Mm -hmm. So I was like, charger. And, like, to me, I didn't click to me, like, oh, is it boyfriend or best friend? You know? So I was like. I mean, you know, we're a thing. I guess. Uh, I guess. She's not even like, she's not even dirt. Like, she got a, she. Mm -hmm. A thing, like, what does that mean? It's complicated. It's like, mm. You just said it's complicated. Like, situationship, talking, dating. You know, it's like, we're on, we're off. I feel like as a black woman, why are you not more upset? That makes me feel like this is, this is not real. Oh, okay, so it's one of those. So are you guys on right now? Okay, she's getting or angry. She's off getting right angry. now. Like, would she care if we hung out tonight? No, I mean we're just we're just hanging out. Yeah, but what if like something happens? Like, <laughs> I don't know if it happens, it happens. You know. How do you take that? I uh, I don't have any words right now. I mean, at the end of the day, like none of my business, and I can care less. You know, I just like. Don't want to step on anyone's toes. No, no, we'll be fine. You know, we're just, we're just hanging out. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm just saying, you never know what's gonna happen. We're gonna be like in the hot tub. It's like if we're gonna be drinking, I'm not gonna let you drive home. You know, like you're obviously more than welcome to stay. Okay, so she wouldn't care. I didn't say that, but. He knows. He knows he's wrong. Like, mm -hmm. He can't he even say. He doesn't want to answer yeah. that. He can't even say it. If it was my girl saying shit like that, bro, oh my god, we going to jail. I mean, I'm going straight to jail. It would be over. It would be over. Okay. Nigga, you don't get no bitch. Okay. Well, I'll see you later. But let me. Look. Her eyes kind of look. Look for this charger. I know it's in one of these drawers. Sorry, I kept you for so long. Uh, it was, you know, good time. We good company. I'm glad. Here, finally. <laughs> what you came for? Thank you so much. Of course. Oh wait, is that the one with the wait, can you see it? Oh wait, that one's mine. Oh. Man. Ugh. Let me check in the room really quickly. This has to be here some you can come with me. Can you help me find it? I don't want to keep you much longer. I'm really Just sorry. Give me all over this. <laughs> you know, alcohol makes you forgetful. Yeah. Let me check over here. Where would it be? Where would it be? Hey, he looking back at that ass. Mm, she, she's so smart. Look at him. <laughs> Damn. Crown catches Sean checking Madeline out. This man was not just looking. He was also licking his lips. Maybe it's over here. So many wires. Yo, she's good at her job. Damn, yo, stop doing that with this ugly ass nigga, bro. Oh. I'm so sorry. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, he, yo, she hate this. B <laughs> yo, she hate this. B but now that I have you here, really, really quickly, I totally forgot to show you something. Okay. Madeline initially gave Sean the wrong charger so that she could bring him back into the office and show off her merch. With the correct charger now literally in his hands, though, he can leave. There is nothing holding him here anymore. Unless, of course, he wants to be here. Okay, sit down. I'm gonna give you a little fashion show. <laughs> okay, he's got the charger. He cannot leave. leave. Go home. He doesn't have to stay anymore. He does not have to stay anymore. He could take off. So I have two designs. These are just like, mo like, like test mock-ups. Mock-ups, like yeah, yeah. You know what it is? I have a different perception on black women when it comes to different states. So maybe LA women are more. They have more, t like you know. Okay, I'm gonna show you the my least favorite. So I have this one. Oh. They tolerate shit more. <laughs> I know. <laughs> How is she not angry? Okay, this is this one. Okay. This one be for the boys. I like it. It's a simple one. So I'm Madeline Monet. I know I didn't tell you that earlier. That's my artist name. It's also my real name, which is like really cool. Beautiful name, honestly. Thank you. Here, you wanna hold it? Check it out. This one is my 
favorite. This one's custom made though. Okay. This one also says time is Monet, but it has Dash ass. Has like a little graphic. Like, like all over. I like that. Is that for the girls on this one? Yeah, it's like a mini dress. That's a it is. <laughs> hey, I want my girls to feel bad. You know, like, I mean, you listen to my music. It's like, nah, yeah. it's sexy, boss, boss, boss bitch, energy, like yeah. sensual, lover girl. I'm dog on her shit. I ain't gonna lie. Hang, hang, hang. Care for him. Sorry. It's pretty good. Can I sit? I'm not gonna lie. I probably would have got bricked. Okay. What? She's oh, sitting on his lap? What the f Man. Oh, and he did the hand placement. This is why we wanted to give Sean the charger before Madeline ultimately sealed the deal. This man had a chance to leave, and even now he has a chance to push her off, but he doesn't. How do you take Nigga, he not gay. I feel like, bro, even if you got a girl, are you like, am I about to be like, whoa, whoa I don't know how. <laughs> I don't know, bro, because it's like, bro, I'm not gay, bro. Like, I never cheated on the girl, but like, bro, I'm not gay, bro. I'll probably just hit him with the... <laughs> take this. This is the job of the How would you take it? Hi. What's up? So what do you think? I like it. Like, you're very creative, you know, in every way. Every... Nigga's saying whatever he needs to to get in the book. Anyway. Yes, I try. I do try. Ah, oh, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. I'm sorry. I do not cry. No, you're good. good. No, you're good. You're good. I'm sorry. In my opinion, there was no point in continuing. She not even crying. Doing this any further? I mean, Sean told Madeline that he and Crown were complicated, that they were on and off. He just he like me. Hang up. <laughs> Say whatever for the pussy. <laughs> He was down for whatevers, and I know Madeline was the one that sat down on oh, his lap, but he could at least say something. Instead, he chooses to put his hand on her waist. That's way too comfortable. Bro, why the f is he letting her sit on his lap like that? He's enjoying this a bit too much. Oh, he probably thinks they really gonna smash. This is ridiculous. This is the end. Oh. This nigga got, yo, I just realized this nigga got on a Wakanda hoodie. I mean, a like Wakanda hat. Oh, God. Yeah, I don't know. I don't really, I don't really have any words right now. Do you see a point in continuing this test to like a- I mean, like- <laughs> She's not crying though. I don't know, this might be fake. Like at this point, I feel like I, I don't need anything else. Um, She's not crying. I got like pretty much everything I needed. So I'm like, it. Yeah. I don't care. I, I'm over this. Yeah, I'm over this. I can't even. Is it hot here? Like, is the- I'm fine, honestly. Oh, you're fine. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. Well, look how he's looking at her, though. That's crazy. <laughs> Did you want to have a conversation with him and confront him about everything? Yeah. What's the point of confronting? This is why I'd be thinking it should be fake, because what's the point of confronting him? Still wanted to do that. What's the point of confronting a, a cheater if you caught them in the act? It doesn't make sense. Yeah, I do. Did you still want to do what we talked about in terms of you going out there without the cameras and kind of like interviewing him to see what reaction he gives you first? Uh. And then the cameras come out. Just so he doesn't like freak out. Yeah. You don't do that. Mm. Okay. It's complicated. Well, so tell me about yourself. Our plan to find out if Sean was cheating with his coworker didn't exactly pan out how we thought it would. However, we did find out that Sean was willing to trade his girlfriend for another girl, which, like I said, says a lot. I hope you guys have your talkies for this because you guys already know. This shit's gonna be good. Remember, it'll be just you until you call out without the cameras. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? What? What, what are you doing, <laughs> mister? I'm not that tipsy, boy. You can't have your way with me. Kyle Nathan, we are ending this here. I will walk you guys when to come in. Okay, perfect. Madeline? Oh, yeah? It sounds like it. <laughs> um, you wanna come out here? Do you wanna, come on. He's so confused, he has no idea what happened. <laughs> Hi, boo. Come on, I wanted to see y'all. <laughs> yeah, how are you? What's up? Why are you acting weird? I'm chilling, how are you? <laughs>
Are you chilling? Why are you over there? I'm like, come here. Like, sit down. Oh, he looks guilty as. Oh, he knows. Oh, he's scared. Sit down. Like, what is so? This nigga is so whitewashed. Nigga, that's your girlfriend. Why are you not sitting next to her? Can I get you a drink, girl? Please. <laughs> so what's up? What you doing? Like, what's yeah, going on? I just, I just came to get the. Oh, you got my charger. Yeah. Thank you. He's either really confused or he knows exactly what happened. So for ten minutes, you've been looking all over the house for this, and nothing was going on. She's a little. Dry. I don't know what to tell you. She's your friend. Okay. What? Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? I just head scratch. It's your friend. Like, what is all this no, hostility? Honestly, like, you're a little I, defensive like, right I now. Like I don't. I don't even understand. Like, yeah, it's not fake. I'm literally. I swear what's, to what's, you. What's I'm just trying to understand. I am just understand. trying to understand. You told me to come get your charger. Right. I have it. It's right there, right? It is right here. Exactly. So, like, what's the problem? Well, the problem is she could have brought that mother charger to the, to the door. Maybe you're acting like this. Bro. Sure. Oh, he knows. He knows why she's there. He knows. Are you serious? Okay. So, quick question. Quick. I'm just yeah. curious. Are we together, in your opinion? We're a couple, not not wishy washy. Like, we are together. We are that a couple. Together, I, mean, right? yeah. I don't know. I'm asking you. You don't got to do all that smart ass. I just want to know if. if I, mean, right? yeah. I don't know. I'm asking you. You don't, don't got to do. Yeah, her body's sexy. You see, like, the. the Damn, I'm, I'm horny, my fault. You all that smart ass. I just want to know if, if you think we're together. If you see yeah, us yeah, as I a couple. Yeah. <sighs> Why are you interrogating me? What's this? You, you told me to come get your charger. I'm here. I'm, I'm interrogating you because you're lying. I'm lying? What do you mean I'm lying? Because you're lying to my face. Now you've been lying to my face. I'm, I'm not acting. Are you dating me right now? You got me up. Her acting insecure. Why didn't you leave? Well, like, I don't gotta answer your question, man. Like, what is all this? I was sitting on your lap for like five minutes. That's how you operate. That's how you do it. I didn't do that. And what the f yo woman be thinking sometimes, bro? Are you serious? I tried to give you like multiple chances to just kind of tell me what the f happened. And I told you what And you told me what the f happened. This nigga suck at manipulating. Happened, uh -huh. but it was all a lie. And you know how I know it was a f lie? How do you know it's a lie? Because I have a whole entire camera crew watching you. We were watching you the whole time. All right. Let's go. Count Nathan, let's go. Just because I knew you were lying, you know, I like I really wanted to. No, that's good. Like, but oh shit! Yeah. You've been lying to me, okay? Bro, also, like, question: Who's who's Ava? What is this? No. Bro, you did all this. You feel like you did something? What the f is this? I don't feel like I did. You did some. F you like what the? F you started from the door, like. I'm freeing my home girl. Home First girl. of all, mm -hmm. you're sabotaging her relationship. That's what you. Am I stop did or did you, you stop it? You were the one with all the compliments and touching me. Nah, bro. Touching you? First of all, what would I have to do touching my friend's boyfriend? Are you kidding me? Well, you did it. And you I'm really, you are really, you are really sitting here after I bro, watched get that camera. Out no, of no, 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 no. Listen, no, you've been on camera all day. It don't, it don't matter. You have, you are sitting here. You are sitting here, getting defensive. Cause y'all are lying. Getting honestly. defensive as. When I watched you this oh, entire, from the moment you walked up to that Bro, what the f is this? Can y'all stop? Can so, y'all stop? <laughs> can y'all stop? No, we're not stopping because you're cut. So, so, Sean, so just so you know, this entire thing was just a loyalty test. Like, we're not stopping because you're cut. So, so, Sean, so just, just so you know, this entire thing was just a loyalty test. Like, your girlfriend wanted to find out if you were loyal to her or not. She felt like you were talking to your coworker. She knows about Evelyn, Ava? When, uh, Evelyn, she knows about your coworker, Evelyn, or something. And she thought that you were obviously cheating on her with her. Bro, I don't know you like. None of this was real, basically. Everybody was in you on this. Here basically. Texting this. No, 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 no. No, stop. Go set this whole up. Because you're so full of You got me up. You won't even own up and be like, yeah, I f***ed up, bro. What the f is wrong with you? You won't even own up and say, I f***ed up. You're playing f***ing games. Like, this I'm is playing. Bullshit. I'm not like, it wasn't even real, so I wasn't even gonna cheat. Like, okay. just me. Nah, bro. You even gonna cheat. Nah. That what is cheating. cheating. What is cheating? That is to you? cheating. What is I'm cheating sorry. to you? Because if I'm sitting on another nigga's lap, how does that feel? What's that? So if, okay, bet. If I go, okay, bet. So if I go sit on another nigga's lap, what's that? Just saying goodbye? Another. Bet. I'm about to go say goodbye to hell. Another fucking Tuesday. Lap? What's that? Just saying goodbye? Another. Bet. I'm about to go say goodbye to hell of niggas. Bet. I should throw this in your face, but I ain't gonna do it because I'm a good person. But you got me hella 
up, bro. Real Nah, y'all look crazy, bro. <sighs> so if I go sit on another nigga lap. Do what you want. You know, you what's said that this called? Up, right? So it's like, I guess we're over already. Do what the you want. Here bro, yeah. get that camera out of my face for real. You don't gotta be here if you don't want it, Sean. You know, we're no, just- No, you don't gotta be I'm here. You don't I don't, it out. I don't, I don't, I don't even know why the you are here. Hey, Take this goddamn hey, stupid hey, ass charger too. I give a charger. The charger. You the charger. Bro, Take the all that. Yeah, 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 bro. You weird as You're weird as I don't give a about no all y'all. Nigga got me, oh my God, he got me so fed up. Oh my. I can't tell if this is real, bro. Oh my God. Y'all think this is real? If he was sincere about it, he was like, okay, you know, like I did f up, this happened, this happened. Okay, that's one thing, you know what I mean? But for you to try to make me feel stupid after you did all that, it's not real. Like, you look stupid. He's sweating, oh yeah, he was sweating crazy. I mean, it is LA. LA be like 98 degrees. God, I'm so hot. Oh my goodness. Damn. Real or not? Nah? Think so? I just feel like at the end, I don't know, because, bro, the nigga. He's whitewashed, so of course he's gonna act like that. Most whitewashed niggas act like that. But I feel like she didn't let, I mean, I don't know, bro. It was just enough, but sometimes it just felt like, like I felt I felt like she should have acted way more, like, you know, aggressive. Uh, he said that they, he said that they were actors. Yeah, the, the female in the white dress is an actor, but I don't know. Y'all let me know in the comments if this shit was fake or not, nah, nigga. That shit. Was, I mean, shit. I was cheating though. If I was him, I was cheating. I was. I was grabbing her. I, I was doing all that. I ain't gonna. Thought it was nothing, got nothing for free. So you ain't getting nothing from me. I married a dumb deal for the fee. In the trash bar, pushing the pee. In the floor, he dropping the jeans. Hundred o'clock TV, he gonna be. Yeah. Like, those who don't hear me, fam.